How's it going guys, Sir Teapot here. Today we are back with more of the story of Teapot. And today is Friday the something of July. I'm not sure what the exact date is. Probably like the 16th, I think it is. Oh, no. You're looking at me for moral support. Yeah, I thought you were going to know. I think it's either like the 15th or 16th or something like that. Uh, but today... 16th. 16th, there we go. <laughs> and today, um, don't... Well, we do have kind of a little bit planned, but nothing too major in a sense. I'm going my hair, I'm getting my hair cut today. Um... Get it cut for free as well, which is great because. All thanks to me. Yeah, because Kim found this thing on Facebook. People they were looking for free male model, well, free haircuts, so they could take pictures of male models. All like, well, I was meant to get my haircut long ago when lockdown first initiated. Basically, was when I went meant to be getting my haircut, and since then, it's just got worse and worse. All like, Do you know what? Might as well. Alt for not nowadays. <coughs> God, sure. Jesus Christ, that hit me in the face. Well, lad, what hell? Um, so yeah, that's not till like quarter, uh, quarter to three this afternoon, so I've got quite a bit of time till then. Um, so for now, I think I'm just gonna chill out and probably play some video games. I'm currently re downloading um, Black Ops Cold War, but I'm only downloading the zombies bit because there's a new zombies map out and I'm watching Syndicate or Tom, whatever you want to call him. Uh, play it yesterday and it was absolutely brilliant to watch like it looked so good and it made me like want to play zombies again it made me rekindle my love for it a little bit so i think i'm gonna get that loaded up shortly once it well once it's finished downloading and then once that's finished downloading i'm gonna be um like i said getting ready to probably head out a bit later on so as i said earlier i'm getting my hair cut today so i am now ready and dressed and everything like that ready to go my hair is looking like an absolute mad one so prepare for all this to be well completely chopped basically I'm gonna have it completely trimmed back all the sides of being cut everything like that the fringe is gonna be like a lot shorter i reckon but it's not gonna be too short i'm gonna keep a little bit of length on it but you'll see the change anywhere so the next time you see me will be me with very yeah very different hair so guys my hair has been cut and it's time for the grand reveal da 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 Oh, my hair is now been cut and it looks rather short it's weird and i feel rather free and it's quite nice sort of to be this free and fresh a little bit because i just feel like there's a bit of weight lifted off my shoulders you could say like it's a bit strange to have this short hair though again like it is very very bizarre i need to like kind of readjust to it like i'm not used to seeing myself like this my, my face looks too thin it looks weird but i just i'll adjust to it over time and i'm hopefully going to try and keep on top of this as well because i just I don't think long hair suits me. I feel like shorter hair does suit me a lot better. So I'm going to try and keep it shorter from now on. I feel like that's the best way going forward. And uh, for now, I'm just going to chill out for a little while. Because it is still stupendously warm like it was yesterday. And today, I'm still not feeling... Like yesterday, I felt ill because of the heat. And again, today, the heat is just bearing down on me. It's making me feel just so off and uh And it's just genuinely... I, I just feel off kilter like my entire equilibrium. I don't know if that's a proper word. Equally, I can't even say it now. I'll take. I'll just say it so stupidly. Equilibrium. There we go. Is completely off kilter. So uh, it's just this weather. I'm just not used to it. But while we're out, I did get some more bits and pieces. I got some Cheetos because you can't beat Cheetos. Got some Dime bars. Got some new chocolate. Cadbury's like Banoffee pie. Banoffee nut crumble. That's the one. I got some knickknacks because knickknacks are god tier. Got him some barbecue hula hoops. Got some steak bakes, because again, always get steak bakes. Some digestives. And then I got myself a can of rain. The sour apple one though this water. time. What? Water. Yep, and then two bottles of flavoured water. So we've got a bottle of what flavours this one? Strawberry and kiwi, and Kim's got the uh, summer fruits one. See, so Kim wants the strawberry and kiwi one. Yeah, summer fruits one's too strong and it gives me a sufferer. See, so yeah, I like it, I love it. And then I've also got myself another pack of rice and cards because I have an obsession I don't know what you're talking about whatsoever. <laughs> oh, I actually got some good cards. Like, like really good ones. So, first, like, rare I got, well, shiny you could call it, was Carrying Cross, NXT Heroes, Four Stars, take it, take it like a champ. Then I got Ric Flair, which... Pretty decent card. I need to get it in the light. There we go. Now you can see him. And then Kim's got my book ready in the background. <laughs> and then I pulled Bank Belair, which is all right. Look, it's an okay card. But this one, this one is the cleat. Creme de creme. 
100 Club Alexa Bliss. Now I've got 100 Club Sasha Blank Banks. There we Sasha go. Sasha Blanks. Blanks. Yeah, so let's look at that beauty. Let's see if I can get it, actually get it to focus. I don't think it will. Oh, focus. I believe in thee. Come on. No, that's not going to focus. There we go. Anyway, it looks pretty fucking cool. So yeah, I'm quite happy oh, no, with the character. that one that I was thinking of. Yeah, I've got the Ele the Firefly Funhouse version of Alexa Bliss. I've got so many Alexa Blisses. There's just so many variants of her as well. It's quite crazy. So doing quite well on my collection so far. So it's it's pretty hefty. Yeah, it's, look at the thickness of it. All oh, the cards are filling up. There's like there's a page that's missing like maybe three cards in total or something like that now. Uh, that one. No, nope, that one. <laughs> Literally that one. Oh. There we go, that one's missing one there. I'm missing Charlotte Flair, literally. One second. <laughs> I'm missing Charlotte Flair from there. I need that one. And then I finish that entire don't thing. Get it if you've got it. <laughs> <laughs> and then on this side, I'm only missing like four on this side as well, which again isn't. Wait, there you go, now you can see it. Four on that side, which isn't too bad either. So I'm getting there, slowly but surely. So, yes, I'm going to start cracking on with putting those away though, because I need to keep them all safe. <laughs> so, it is now Evie's bedtime. Um, that's why, well. No, I can't really tell where I am because it's a white wall they should behind me, but uh, now in Every Evie's room. Every wall's a white wall. Yeah, literally though, in Evie's room now, and uh, it's heat because, well, it is like, what time? Oh, Half past six, yeah, and we're trying to get Evie to sleep on her big bed tonight. She decided on her own she wanted to do it, yeah. and I am absolutely terrified. Yeah, <laughs> we're worried to say that she's going to end up falling off or something like that, so we're kind of like taking plenty of precautions and stuff like that, putting teddies everywhere and stuff like that, make sure she doesn't fall off. I'm going to get like a proper barrier though at some point for it. Oh, well, fingers crossed, because we've been struggling to find one, to be honest. Like, it's been a bit of a nightmare. Nightmare just getting hold of one, which is rather bizarre. But she's just playing a little bit with her teddies at the moment. And uh, once we get Eve to bed, it's just going to be chilling out for the rest of the evening. Right, guys, so once again, literally, I forgot to vlog my outro because I'm an absolute idiot. And I forgot to film last night, to be honest, as well, because uh, last night I ended up just. Playing a little bit of Cyberpunk and Kim was sat on end of bed just watching me play it. And um, then it got to like 11 o'clock ish. And due to the heat being so ridiculous, Kim ended up going to sleep early because she was absolutely exhausted. And then about 20 minutes later, I, my body just went into full shutdown mode and went, Sleep, you need it. <laughs> and I went, For fuck's sake, really? And then just sat in my chair, started to fall asleep. So I went, You know what? I'm going to get up and just go to bed. So I ended up going to sleep by about half past 11 last night. It was. Excuse me, ridiculous. Literally, it was quite quite ridiculous to me. So that's why there wasn't really much going on last night. Well, there wasn't much to film or anything like that because we just potatoed yesterday because it was just too warm. And again today, it's too chuffing warm. So get ready for your faces for tomorrow vlog of probably me sat in my computer chair most of the day being like, it's too warm. <laughs> but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the rest of your day. And if you did enjoy today's vlog, <coughs> God, excuse me. Make sure you do leave a like and do subscribe. Also, you can share this with your friends. That helped massively because the more people that know about it, the better it is for all of us. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, and I shall hopefully see you all tomorrow for the next daily vlog. And peace, guys.